Bro, 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 Send back, baby. Come on, man. <laughs> oh, come on. What's the reason why we're still out here? Reason. Reason. Oh, my lay. Oh, my lay. Yeah, he, tune, he tune, deep, still. You know. This is where Lagos meets London. Where Peckham boys chill in Osaka, London. As Moritala Mohammed, Heathrow is, on, is where London Bridge links to Milan Bridge via Coast. This is where Lagos meets London. Hey guys, as you already know, this is where Lagos meets London, yeah, man. Lagos London, man. Welcome back to another episode of Lagos meets London. Yeah. Um, today we us, the boys, they finally got in their call up. They've honored their call up. I have two two friends of the podcast with us. I'll probably say, I'll say, yeah, I'll, I'll say they are, they're my brothers, to be honest. Mm-hmm. One of them used to work for Roman Abramovich. <laughs> Abramovich was his ex boss, <laughs> and the other one allegedly is the flyest nigga in South East London. Allegedly, ladies and gentlemen, send back, baby. Come on, come <laughs> on, come on, come on. Come on. Tell you, tell you, tell you, no, you apologies. I should yourself. say this to before we introduce ourselves. Apologies. This is meant to be like something that should have come out a while Ages back, ago. but obviously. Availability. No, no, it's right not. A, I'm a snitch. It's all his fault. Like, yeah, no, it is. Real. I'll take yeah. that. But I, what I'll say is, Dan has always been off front with me. You know, what I mean? every time we've counseled, you say he's it's yeah, all on me, yeah, bro, so bro. which I, I read and, yeah, and I understand. I this is even me. without him. This is even without him. Yeah, I literally you know say, bro, me. it is all me. Me. Uh, make sure you apologize to the other guys in the chat. So, like, even again, there should be another time where we. Uh, mingle with some of the other guys on the pod as well. Like, oh, definitely, hundred I mean, percent. So. And I was just going to say, please, before you guys tune away, it's not a male-only podcast, <laughs> <laughs> but it's a clearly I'm at, isn't it? <laughs> So yeah, we do have. Obviously, there's train strikes today in London, and we have people that have some of our hosts. They've moved a little bit outside of London, like Kent, Luton. So they were unable to make it today because of the train strikes. That's why we just wanted. We decided to just go ahead with it. Obviously, there will still be. Another episode, which we would all record. The studio is also getting bigger and they would all be able to record something. I know you guys on your podcast, you always start with a song. I was thinking, yeah, just to warm up. What what song have I been singing? No, no, no. I'm the one that's going to bring the song. And I don't want you guys to, please don't disappoint me. Okay, okay. Yeah, man. I've been trying to learn the lyrics, but. Okay. I've got a song I've been singing. It's not. Okay, we'll do one for me. And then one we'll do one from you guys. Okay, okay. Yeah. Come on. Right, cool. Cool. But please, What's you guys that? should not embarrass What me. are you getting up? The lyrics? Yeah, man. I've tried to memorize it, but I just felt... Jesus. I'm on. I'm under pressure. Hey, this is pressure, though. Yeah, this yeah, is pressure. We're the ones who do don't mess up and you're trying to mess up us. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... As I did not dig do, start with the move. Start with the move like you smoke kalaku. Just they bounce with the groove. No carry do. If you lose God, then go bounce with your boot. I can vouch for my crew. I'm telling you. Then then today do lifestyle of a crew. Make you dance, no they look. No good they look. If I do 1990s, he go remember. I do my love without talking up. I can buy you. No, I can buy you. Hey, that. Jules, uh, make you know they shall lie. I don't want nobody to give my matter cake. For this life I day, I want to be celebrated. Don't wanna waste my days, I want to spend them on enjoyment. It's plenty of Oh, Diane, uh, see you. Uh, hey, that was good, man. That nah, was you, good. Yeah, we we'll tried, we we'll tried, we we'll we'll tried. We'll try, we'll try. No, I don't. But you, you, yeah, you, you, you flopped the little. I flopped, I flopped. Yeah, I yeah, know, yeah. man. It got, it got with to the lyrics. With the lyrics, yeah. 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 That's a pound. <laughs> it got, I flopped, I flopped. <laughs> with but the do you know the funniest thing? The part I read out. Mm. If I'm singing the song, I don't really know it. Mm. Uh, but the part after it, I know yeah, it. Like, yeah, 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 that's the part I flopped. Yeah, that's yeah, what most songs do. Most songs. Bro, look at most. Most of Asha Ken's songs, yeah, like on the new album, I know the chorus quite well, but the verses, still a bit difficult to to pick it up. Do you know what I mean? But what so, is it though? Like, if you're listening to it, you can you can go, you can flow with it. It's, it's like it's everything with life. It's um perfect example is and obviously, just when I play drums, yeah, sometimes, 
when you learn like a song on drums, yeah, you learn it whilst you're listening to the song and it's easy to play along because mm-hmm. you know what's coming next. Mm-hmm. When you can't hear the song anymore and you've got to play the parts, you can't. it's harder. Like, yeah. it's, it's not that you can't, but it's harder. Yeah. It's the same with music, like when you're learning the song and actually singing it. When you when you can hear it, yeah. bro, think about it. Concerts, like we can, more time we can sing it word for word because we know the song's coming up. Bro, mm-hmm. you, you got, you went Bonner Boy. Nah, nah I, didn't, I didn't, you know. Because he was singing this song at, like without... Yeah. No sound, nothing, just him yeah, and the yeah. crowd. And I was able to sing along. Mm, yeah. I don't know what happened now, man. It happens, man. Pressure, man. <laughs> don't Come worry, on, man. You get it next time. All right, people, send back podcasts. Come on, you man. Check them on Instagram. Check them you on YouTube. Sing our song, man. And subscribe. Bro, these people, they're going to go away if they see the only guys. <laughs> so let them... <laughs> 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 subscribe. Let them... Guys, right. subscribe. And you already know, man. Lego Smith's London. Don't right. forget to like, comment. Like, subscribe. You guys wear Madame Joyce. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Did you stay to the end. No. Fucking no. hell, man. Have you seen the videos? No. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh, oh. Subscribe, you subscribe. Oh, yeah, I think I've seen Don't that. forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. subscribe. Yeah, I seen that, you know. That's no, a crazy that, song, you know. No, in that, in that episodes. Oh, did yeah. you come Don't up with that song? Don't forget to yeah. subscribe, subscribe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, what you might, what song are you? What song am I singing? Should sing, sing, I get my song first? Song I've been banging out recently. What is the reason you do not have your, your own peace <laughs> of mind? <laughs> are you having fun or are you doing these things to survive? Are you taking the pictures of every memories, memories of, of your life? life? What's mm. the reason why we're still out here? Reason. Reason. Omale. 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 Yeah. Two. Yeah, two. Two. V. V. Gospel, bro. It's like a what, TikTok sound. What bro. do you think about Omale, though? I think it's cold. I think it's called my favorite album, bro. Afro Depression. My favorite album. <laughs> Afro Depression. Yeah, that's, what, that's his genre. genre. <laughs> it's my favorite. It's my favorite album. There's a lot of my favorite album this year. Should I say something though? Huh? Two things. Huh? My two biggest problems about Omale, and I don't even. It's not even a hot take, but it's me just analyzing. One, his tiny desk was awful. Yeah. His what? His tiny desk. Yeah, the he done a t- the acoustic. He oh, did okay. a tiny desk, and Bad. it just showed me like vocals poor. Not there. Not there. And secondly, because when he broke out, bro, he was like my number one artist. But I just do not think he's versatile. And it's, it's yeah. not to get onto him or anything, but I just think that sometimes I'm like, bro, I'm actually listening to you again. <laughs> like the same fair, vibe. Like, and it's not to hate on him, in it, but nah, I just fair. feel like with the way Afrobeats is going now and people are breaking into different cultures and that, I just think Omale is, could miss out if he's not like... Careful. Do you know what I'm saying? I think he's got a niche though, which is the Afro depression and stuff. Like the Afro, like the Afro woke, Afro, you mm. know, I've had a long day. You know, I think he's good at it. I think he's talented. I do think he's not like, he's not like he's not versatile. Like when you see him, that remember that like, um, Infinity, like that was, that showed him in a different light. That's the first song of his I heard. That's Wait. a bit more vibey. His vibey song is probably um, Philo. Huh? Philo. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. another versatile song. Yeah, yeah. Not versatile, but it's it, different. It, no. It's different. No, no, yeah, it's yeah. not even a versatile, you're right. It's not, yeah, it's, it's not, not versatile, but it was, but it was a bit different. It's just because of the way Soweto went. It's, it's, for him, it's a bit hard. You know, some artists, they, they'll touch your eyes and it's a bit hard to replicate. I know what you mean, but I feel I like he's agree. got, I feel like he's all right, you know. I feel like he's got a neat, he's got a, he's got a, like a group. He's got a fan base. You talk about that height. Yeah. It would be the same with Charlie, Charlie Poppy too. Charlie Poppy? You, do you know Charlie Poppy? Elon Musk in a Pluto, but you haven't heard Elon Musk. Yeah, I have, 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 I have. I just don't know who the artist is. His name is Charlie Poppy. Yeah, 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 that's how he can't. That's yeah. how he's not getting any hair hair else. He needs. To, that's why he just keeps doing features. Like yeah. every every so time I'll he say, does yeah, it. Yeah, I'll say it's Lata and Shay vibes. Mm-mm. I think I don't think Shay vibes. I don't think he has. I don't think he has another level. Yeah, he, yeah, does, yeah, he, does, he does. He does. He does. He does. He does. He does. What else is he it's doing? Gonna, he's gonna be exactly like Asha Kerr, bro. It's like everyone nah, wants nah, to have nah, another level. Nah, what nah, he did. Asha Kerr's got bare level. No, but the level is different, though. You can't compare the Asha Kerr level. You can't. You can't. No, no, they're not the same level. But I'm saying that everyone thought that. um um, uh, Mr. Money with a vibe was just that was him. Then when he gave us the new thing now, a work of art, that was there's never gonna come a point where Shady Vibes is gonna dare 
try to do a show at the O2s. That's never happened. You never know. Bro. I'm him, telling him doing well, a show. A him doing a show in the Indigo already in itself. It's, it's bro, not it's obviously not. not bro, I don't think they've. they've he's sold not selling out. out tickets, uh, are you mad? <laughs> I don't think they've sold out. Not, tickets, he's not selling out. It's not easy, bro. Do it's you know what it is to come to London to sell out? As a Nigerian artist, and he's not even like. Of course, the Asher Curtain. Yeah, I know it's like. Um, Bear Yoruba, of course, it's like um, mm. specific to one culture, but a lot of people have taken it in. Show you vibes, even as Yorubas, I still it's very struggle. indigenous, <laughs> bro. It's very, it's very so hard. indigenous. But he does, hard, hey, bro. one of his bangers, though, that I really like is Man of the Year. I can be the man of the year, too. Man, that song is cold. Man, suddenly, with Young John. Uh, I hear it, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you just like Young John. Young John's, it's the young John, young John's cold, man. Young yeah, John's it is. Cold. It's even. Even like Zinoliski, they have to think about it properly before we even attempt to say, mm, Zinoliski? Side of Iron, I just don't think it's the I don't know. Like, hey, no, man. No, 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 but no. Don't do that. Good. That's don't guy. do that, good. bro. Hey. He's good. I already, he was in my ones to watch for 2023 and he hasn't disappointed me one bit. But He hasn't disappointed me. But okay. I still feel like I just don't think he's all that. You have to remember. Even bro, I think Vesaya. he's all that, though. I already <laughs> say Zinoliski just needs to be managed bro. by like people that manage someone like Rema, bro. Mm. Rather can, than... Yeah, um, yeah rather yeah, than yeah, just people like them. No offense, Gabby. I'm sorry. No offense. I've just That's just my opinion. I thought, but Naira is like... The way he's shooting these videos and that, he's doing it at a high level. Like that video you shot in London. He's not a good different. manager, though. He's not good management. They haven't got a good production team around the market. Fair enough. Look at some of the... Bro, look at... Every, look at the mobile situation. As yeah, but that's example. that happens in Elocity. That happens in the UK, too. I know. People just shine bad To the point deals. where the art... Actually, do you know what? You're right. You get happens right. It happens to everyone, bro. Right. No, I, th- I think now music is so competitive. You need... It's not even about the music videos you're shooting. Bro, look at Rema. He just signed... I don't know when this is going to come out, but he just signed 23. Like he did a photo shoot with Michael Jordan. Mm. Did you see that yesterday? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, oh, yeah he brought, yeah, he brought he's Jordans. Not, he's not an ambassador for Jordan. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. Like, Tim Shea was see, part of it. They're... No, but Rema's one. He's just gone to a different. Well, that's level. because the way they managed him. Yeah, I wouldn't they say the, the but talent. That's Jazzy, bro. Zeno, Zeno doesn't have Zeno and Rema. I wouldn't say Rema has more talent than Zeno. It's on Jazzy, bro. But but the way now nah, music is so competitive, bro. It's the same with like, Omale. They, they, these guys are blowing off of TikTok and yeah, the way they're doing their marketing. Yeah, yeah. Mm. It, bro, yeah. Zeno is Italian, man. He's been singing since, bro. Back in the day. Like 16, year, 16 years old. I can remember his, his first song. Mm. He he was actually the real Afro depression. Mm. Before, oh, now, yeah. before now, he's, he has a little bit of money. Yeah. Now he's just thinking about like the good life. Bro. Mm. Yeah, man. I think it's good, though. Zeno is very good. What, so, like, obviously, it's off the back of what Kamil said to me one time. And it, this wasn't even on the podcast. We'll probably address it on our own pod, yeah. But he was like, he said, and I want to get your thoughts, yeah. He said, Song of the Year is Aquafina, Young John. And I said, that's blasphemy. Song of which year? 20, 2023. No not, way. It's not my Song of the Year anymore. Oh, okay. <laughs> you see, so why did you say that? It was, it was, it was. It was, it was. Aquafina. The song has come out. So one, what song? Is, song? Reason is my Song of 2023, bro. Mad? Reason? Yes, Reason what is my Song of 2023. What are you saying? Not your song. I'm saying the song of 2023. Oh, man. like the overall song of, of the course, year. Of course, sir. Yeah, oh. not, your, not your song. No, nah, of course it's not Aquafina. Aquafina's never been Young John's song of the year. What's like, Young John's <laughs> song of the year? Like, like, probably, like, I don't know, maybe even Stamina came out this year, right? Or did it come out last year? Stamina's not his song, is it? I know, but I'm saying the song that he's been a part of. I think it's one of his first singles of 2023, so yeah, but it's not now. Nah, of course it's not the overall song of the year. What's the overall song of the year? So Afrobeat about? wise. Yeah. Probably Party No They Stop. No. Yes. <laughs> no, it is not. Probably, you'll be surprised. <laughs> it is not party. What is it then? Not. What is it? I'm trying to think, yeah, but it's, it's just not, not. You think it's 230, but it's not. Open your eyes, bro. Is part, think is, past is, is all the Yoruba list. people, bro. Listen, listen. You're just that bad. Unavailable, man. first of all, is bigger than. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Unavailable, yeah, unavailable, yeah, of course it would 100%. be. 100%. Yeah, but that that's, doesn't count. That's what? How does it count? It does count. You're right. <laughs> bro. Well, why doesn't he? Why did nah, you say it doesn't count? Because he was thinking of something to fill it up with. Nah, it's commercial, commercial, but it is a song. What do you think the song of the year is, though? Bro, it's right now, it's so, there's so many songs coming there out. There ain't that many, bro. Bro, when you think about that, there isn't there's, that many. Bro, there's a lot. There's not. But if you look at Shakir's album, I can There's easily... no song there that's song of the year, though. None. Why Why do you think that? There isn't. It's a very good album, by the way. I like it way more than he does. I like it as well, bro. You don't rate it I the do. way you should. I do, but I just... Yeah, I don't. Because but... if you... um, What's it called? What's the first album called What's again? The money, the money with the Vibe. That, um, was a, that was that's, a, that's a that's that's a ten out. I think that's a ten out. That was a work of art. I think that's a ten. That was a work of that was a work of art. Yeah, that was a very good album. I think that's a ten out of ten album. Yes. What are you rating work of art? Uh, Seven point five. Okay, that's higher than I've seen. What are you rating? What's the name of Davido's new album again? Timeless. Timeless. Eight point eight. Timeless is like an eight point five. You know, I listened to that the other day and I was like, "Timeless is amazing." What like he? 
Bro, songs like In the Garden, yeah, that don't even get respect. Bro, that is a that's, brainy I always, song. I, that's what I always say. I know it's, it's wild, but that song, yeah. So good. In, in the, the garden. garden. Oh, oh, my head. Head. Bro, cold. Bro, again? that song's Mo- cold. Uh, Morave. 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 And that's our yeah. first, like, if it's like a professional uh, debut. Yeah, that's our first yeah, song yeah, ever, bro. Yeah. And the production. Oh, yeah, bro, bro, yeah, when yeah, I first yeah. listened to that song, yeah, I went back, I was listening to like the, like, you see, when you listen to a song and you're going Beyond like the lyrics, listening to the mixing and everything. What As song, I say it all the That's time. That's a good song. Whenever artists are making music from a place of heartache, they make their best music. <laughs> oh yeah, I mean, yeah. Man, nice. man's best song was literally that. This this whole album was heartache for David. Mm. What, what happened with his child? And that's why this was his best work. He didn't do no American features. He just done it pure and raw. And that's why it's the best. Yeah, th- it's um, the best album. You think it's better than a good time? Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I think it is. It is. But it I is. like no, a good time. I think good time David. I think David O's first album. A good time. Very f- no, it's the very first one. I'm a Babolo. I yeah. think it's better. I don't. I don't go for that. I don't like that. That I was. That was. Have you listened to the song? That was auto tune to the call. That's what he thought it was a rapper. Go for it. Go for it. Nah, I don't think I was. Nah, it was not at all. No, it was. It was a good time. A good time was good. A better time was even colder though. No, a good well, time. You time is better than a bad time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You can feel like, my eyes, oh baby, Joe. Uh, uh, will you be my wife, oh lady, uh, baby? Uh, One day my life gon' de ghetto, de best, de ghetto, show ghetto, for ghetto, for ghetto. Me, I want tanana. Me, I want tanana. Oh my god, no. A bad time was better than a good time, bro. No, a good time is better. better it's not, it's not. A bad time has got bangers. Sweet in the middle, you know. You know, you bro, know. Bad time has got the tune with him and Nicki Minaj as well. Holy Grail. Oh is my oh, days. Yeah, Holy Grail is hard. And oh, then that song the, with Lil Baby. That song is awful. I got that six tattoo. I got that six tattoos. Oh my <laughs> god. Nah. A bad time is different. No, no, no. A bro, time, are you not deep? A bad time is different. Joel jo- jo- is one of his best ever songs. From when you have sweet in the middle, yeah, you're done. Nah, like, even, nah. even the intro, I'm on the a intro, vanity. yes. Yeah. Um, green, Everything green light I do is a lifestyle. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah the the DNG, 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 DNG. Oh my, yeah, DNG is one of his best songs. Yeah. Bro. Bro. It's not bad, David. Bro, it's, it's, it's his most underrated song ever. Hundred percent. So, what's yeah? What's let me, let me start. I think I've I've heard a little bit of your own same backstory, but I haven't heard yours. I've never you heard. Nah, Are you sure? I, one, one thing that one thing I did was I tried not to listen to that when you guys come, come on. To it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I hear, I hear. So I did your. Where were you, where were you living? I was you? living in. Um, were you born here? I was born here. Yeah, living in South Luton. When I went to Nigeria, wait, was, like, how did it happen? How did it happen? Yeah. Um. So obviously, I've got three older brothers, and obviously, like in the UK, like they were, they were obviously they were at that age, that like, you know, the the teens, that like, fifteen, sixteen, and I had an older brother that was like twenty, twenty one, twenty two, and obviously he was. You know, just doing what kids, just doing what guys would do, you know. And my brother, my two brothers that were close in age, um, Timur and Mitch, they were, you know, in gangs with these kind of things. And my mum was just like, I don't want you to go through that. So none of them went to Nigeria. Like my brother, <laughs> he got taken there. My oldest brother got taken there. But he, my, my my nan, no, my granddad, he weren't even his granddad, was like, nah, don't, that's deep. Like, don't leave him. So he, <laughs> he, he bus case in it. But me, my mum was like, yeah, I don't really want you to be like them. Just go in it. So I was like, okay, I, I don't want to go. Like, I don't think it's going to happen. She told me year oh, five. Hi. She told me when I was nine, nine, 10 and 10, but I didn't believe her. <laughs> then when I was 11, like it happened, I got I got sent there. Yeah. So I went there. I lived in Ikorodu or Dugunyo. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> You're saying it so lightly, man. Like, yeah, like. Maybe because I've spoken about it so many times now, but oh, I, like, okay. I'm used to it. But it's like, like I mean, it, yeah, like it, it was real. Like it was like, you know, if we go into detail, like, you know, imagine everyone's finding secondary schools and you just know damn well you're not going to any of them with mm. them. Like, I haven't, and, I, and obviously you have to pretend like you are. So I'm going to opening days. My name was, like, I had registered for a secondary school. Do in you the remember? UK. Do you remember? How, were you just like, okay, you're, were you doing it because, oh, my mom said I should do it? Or did you rebel? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a bad child. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. Like, I know a lot rebel. of people that wouldn't have done it. Like, my brothers wouldn't, have, my brothers would have said no. <laughs> but I was just that, like, because my older brothers were like, just go. I was like, you know what? Cool. I'll just go in it. Like, but it was hard. I was crying every day and stuff. Like every day when you were about to go or when you got to Nige. When I got to Nige. Bro, Ikoro too. And at that time, man, Ikoro is like one of the, the cars, underdeveloped, bro. Underdeveloped. Oh, That's where my grandma used to say. Potholes. Nigga. Nigga. You absorb it's gonna 
hey, that was our or doing it was rough, bro. There was a time where we had no electric for three months. Yeah, man. No lap for three months. Wait, so when you got Lagos, Muitala Mohamed, blah, 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 was there, so who picked you up from airport? My, we went, we arrived in Abuja because okay. I wanted to see, I had to see my uncle and I think my mom had some stuff to do there. Okay. So from, uh, oh, you went with your mom? Yeah, I went with my mom and I was under the impression she was staying with me in Nigeria, <laughs> not knowing that she was coming back to the UK. I don't know why I thought she would stay there with me. So when I found out she was going back, I was crying. And I didn't eat for like a day. I didn't talk to no one in the house. I was airing everyone. I was like, nah, like how am I staying here without my mum? And then after a while, she just swindled me into just accepting it. So I just accepted it. And yeah, I went boarding school. Oh, you went boarding school? Yeah, Which I went one? boarding. I went to, it was a new school. So when I got to my school, the highest year was JS3. When I joined in JS1, the school, name of my school was called Canon James Pierre's Anglican College. <laughs> was it in the court? No, it was in, it was in Yaba, Iwaya. Hey! That's where I grew up, man. Yeah. Canon James Pierce. Yes, yeah. Next uh, to next, uh, um, St. Francis Church. Oh, yeah. Anglican Church. It was inside yeah, the same, yeah, yeah, inside yeah. The same it's, compound. It's in, it's in like an estate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a yeah. very quiet area. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I think yeah. they might probably have changed the name or something. Maybe. I don't yeah, know. I think so. Yeah, mm-hmm. Canon James Pierce, man. <laughs> so <laughs> when, when did you come back? I came back. So when I went in, I went in 09. That's when I finished year, year six. Then I came back for summer holidays in 2010. Then I've gone back there to do year eight, so JS2. I meant to do JS3, but my dad raised like a, where is my child kind of thing. So I think my mom was in the UK, like she's still like, she's working. She's still like claiming like benefits on me as I'm there. So they were like, where is he though? So I had to come back prematurely. So I came back in 2011, year eight. I didn't even finish year eight. Like I done, I done my exams early in Nigeria. Didn't even use them, but yeah. How about you, Dan? <laughs> yeah, no, like... So wasn't, it wasn't because you were behaving badly nope. then? Yeah, just because I could... For, I, there was a possibility. That you so could? <laughs> yeah, that I could. Yeah, mine's not as, like, gritty as that, like... I feel like yours was deep, though. I can't lie. Yeah, yeah man, it's so sad, man. I'm just like, saying it, like... Yours, yours is a product of it's your unfair. brother's family. It's unfair. No, no, no. Can't say it's unfair. But it was good. Don't worry, when good. we chat to Timbo, man, I'll get on to him G, still. G him up. G check him still, but... um. But what your brothers now, like obviously I'm not I don't want you to bet them out. Right? Yeah, yeah. They're married and everything. Right? Yeah, yeah my brothers get one of my brothers getting married next month. Like my brothers are doing their thing, like my brothers make music. I was living at a show the other day, like they're oh, okay. all good, they've all got kids now. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Like yeah, like they're all giving living a normal life. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, makes sense, man. F- for me it's just make it short and sweet. Um I left the same time as him, so it's did Wait, did you guys know each other before you went? <laughs> no, 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 okay. no, 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 no. We always used to make that joke though that we were on the same <laughs> same flight. Same flight there. Where, where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, we could have been Spider-Man. though. You, know, you, uh, <laughs> you went to BJ as well, innit? Yeah, what's yeah, the name of what's the no, name no, of this? No, but mine was before, innit? Because I I I like the thing is I lived a good life here, yeah, but in a bad city. So my first year, so I only spent one year, so year seven, and I spent it in Port Harcourt. No, but when you was going to Nigeria from the UK, where did you what city did you land in? Lagos, Lagos. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, okay, fair. Because we went there to just chill for the summer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before yeah, I then yeah. started school. Yeah, sure. Get so it. then my dad got like moved to or what's it called? Transferred, didn't Transferred. it? Transferred. Was he working um, oil and gas? Yeah, 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 yeah. So he's a that's geologist. Dang- that's Dangle to his brother, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Dangle to his I wish, brother. I wish. But um, yeah, yeah, literally Port Harcourt, and that was gory, man. That was not fun, especially back in the day. Like, obviously, we lived in a good area, so we lived in like I, I think it was like GRA and that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man, Port Harcourt, they have a lot of GRAs for all these people that are working in oil but and gas. When you get to the real Port Harcourt, I always wanted to go though. Is it mad there? It's and the Port Harcourt when they, they kill Sobuma, <laughs> bro. Like Port Harcourt is not. You don't. Why, why, why did they? Why did they? Why did it? Why did you? Why did you have to go back? Were you born here? Yeah, I was born here, but then like my parents were getting back together because they were like separated, didn't okay. they? So they weren't living together. My mum was obviously living in the UK and my dad was living in Nigeria. so they okay. weren't together at the time, but then flew back because they wanted to like, live together with family. Into- yeah, okay. yeah, exactly. Do you know what I'm saying? So um done that now, flew over there and then after a year, moved to Abuja because my dad got moved again. Okay. Um, and that's where we stayed for the next two years. So obviously he came back in year nine. Mm-hmm. And then I came back in year ten, so just a year. So you later. came back, with mom and dad, all of you. No, 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 just mom. Dad's what did you get? Your, what did you get? In your junior Wyatt? <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> bro, I failed junior Wyatt. Because I know. didn't get to do it, innit? So I've never asked you that before, bro. I failed it. I asked you to go on the pod as well. Thanks. I shout out to my mom. I failed it, man. You failed it. How bro, can you yeah, shout out your mom though? 
because this is what happened. Yeah, bro, I was a very, I think I might have had ADHD. There must have been a problem. But during Gino Waek, yeah, I was the one organizing football tournaments, bro. <laughs> during, <laughs> <laughs> during Gino Waek, bro. I was a mad, like, it's not like, it's not as if I'm not smart or anything, but it's just, I was so crazy about football. Mm. We're having, say we have a paper at 10 a.m. I'll set a match for like between seven and eight when you're supposed to be revising. <laughs> And then you what, will people actually come? Bro, that's a to see. We know ourselves, like mad people. So bro, so this is what, because I think they do like A, B, C, I can't remember now. So Yeah, you shade it in, innit? No, like the grids. It's yeah. so like A for pass, B, then C, D. Yeah, yeah. So D, from D downwards is like fail. fail. You have to do it again. So uh, if you have more Ds, than the other ones yeah then you have to repeat it man mm. so bro i had s so many d's and then when they marked it like <laughs> they were saying like it was just yeah, like one boy, mark one mark two marks difference one mark two marks difference i was like so what did your mom do so my mom like bro my mom went to plead to them oh man. my like, god she put me on probation like <laughs> like did she let me yeah, go yeah yeah but just watch you in, like my first term in ss1 mm. then yeah they'll make a decision they'll then. make a decision then and, then and did you watch case yeah, man. Yeah, um, I mean, most if he's already, no one's gonna send yeah, you back. Yeah, again, you already got Obviously, now. you already yeah. got your. Yeah, they don't, you're able they don't to pass case they don't after care. that, they don't care. bro. It was my bro. Yeah, <laughs> I failed, man. <laughs> I can't remember. Like, you I'm, stop no, lying, no, no. man. God knows, <laughs> man. Man. God knows, bro. You, you <laughs> think, bro? Yeah, when yeah, I was in Nigeria, yeah. I was a smart kid, by the way. Just that's what I'm saying. When I was, I can't remember, bro, because when I was in year seven, um, it was it was the first time I ever was like um exposed to rankings. So obviously, like when I heard that there were rankings, I was gas. First, bro. Term, first, first term to like was, last, bro. Was, to like, was that was first oh, yeah, term man. mad for you because you didn't know about the rankings? Then second term you had to pattern up. That's how it was for me. No, no. So what happened was I I took the exams and then I think the first the first time out of um twenty five kids in the class I finished ninth mm. and I wasn't feeling it. Like yeah, I'm, yeah, even yeah, my dad yeah, was yeah. like ninth, yeah, same, bro. Come same. on. But obviously I was never getting first because you know the guy that's first, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Always one nerd that's, like, young, that's younger than you as well. Oh, like. That's so good, and his handwriting is better than everyone. <laughs> everyone, bro. Like, his handwriting that's is the best. Fucking, <laughs> fuck, that's my best friend now, you know. Orange, you know, do uh, bro. bro, you know his handwriting. They'll say, Why can't you, you be like this, this boy? <laughs> Why can't you all so be like this? Stand up. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. Does he have two heads? <laughs> no, do you know what they actually did? There was a time they said, So the teacher came in and said, um, good everyone said, Good afternoon. So, good that, afternoon, mm, sir. Uh, We're happy to see mm, you, bro. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> yeah, <we've been laughs> <through the laughs> yeah. bro. So, deeper, yeah, they've told him now. They said, Bring your notes, bring your notes. So, they got the guy that finishes first. They brought your notes. The teacher was like, I'm not writing notes today. You lot are all copying notes from his book, like all. You're all copying books from one by one. You start copying the notes, and that's how it's gonna run. Like, bro, when you finish first, different. live a different life. The teachers talk to you different. Yeah, live a different. I, bro, different I, I was, I never finish. But I was lucky because our classes used to be like fifty people. Oh. So for you to finish fifty, fifty of them, that means you're useless, man. <laughs> no, no, fifty, yeah, you have to be mad. You are very, very like, useless. What are you doing? <laughs> I'll be like, bro, I'll always be like one to like 27, 30 yeah, in that yeah, era. Yeah. Then mm. you're happy, man. On the yeah, last day of yeah. school, you know, yeah. you're good. You enjoy yeah, your yeah, summer yeah. holiday. Yeah. I never try, I never try, uh, strive to be first. I, I said I never strive. I've never been to you, but I just you wanted to be first. Yeah, yeah man. I, I got, what was the highest you finished? Fifth. Fifth. That was yeah, it. That's fifth. Good. I finished five. fifth once too. And I, my, they bought me a PS1. Is it? That was that was my highest. That was my Mbappe level. My highest was third. My best as well. My highest was third. Third? Ah, third is mad, Because I think it was one day third is top three. That's podium, bro. Bro, that's, yeah. that's proper. But you know me, I've always been like, you know, yeah, man, where you want to be. Yeah, because I want to be in Nigeria, it's cool to be smart, isn't it? Yeah. So it's like, when I came back, like when I came up from the summer holiday, um, because like when I my first time, like you, I finished eleventh, innit? My grandma was at like, eleven. You think I'm sending you coming from the UK <laughs> to finish eleven? He said this Christmas holiday, you're gonna have a tutor. Oh yeah. I had a master the whole Christmas. Like so when I got back now, I was taking it seriously. Like, when everyone was outside, like, this is like the first day back, I was in the classroom revising. The first test, I got 20 out of 20 for science. Everyone's like, yeah, can move, yeah, can move. I was on it. I was on it. Like, yeah, I'll finish fifth. And then third term, 
Remember, because third term is a, it's the adding of your first term and second term and then yeah, you yeah, overall grade. Yeah. So yeah. because of that, I think it's sixth, innit? Okay. Because I think I would have killed the third term as well, innit? But because mm. of my first term, it let me down. Then, do then like JS, average. Yeah, mm. then JSU, I didn't care. JSU, I finished finishing sixth. I finished sixth, sixth, seventh, yeah. Mm. With me, it was, I was good in some subjects and with some subjects. What was your I best subject? I didn't care, man. What was your best subject? My best subject was like English. English, what, what was yours? Oh. You know what my best subject was? Yoruba, you know? Really? Yeah. But, Yoruba, I was very good with Yoruba. I used to get A's, yeah, we but it wasn't my, my favourite one. We didn't English. do Yoruba. That was the sad thing. Because of Potakot. Potakot, we did Igbo. Yeah, did Igbo. And then when I went to Abuja, we had to do Hausa. Yeah. So we did, I never so got to do to Yoruba. Get a, yeah, like Yoruba. I got, because in my, in my class, there was obviously JS1A, JS1B. Oh, yeah. JS1 when you B, think about it though, Yoruba is not, it, it wouldn't be hard. hard. It's not hard. Don't it's you think so? Like, Yoruba is just like... It's easy. It's easy. It's just like studying. How would I put it? It's, it's like a lifestyle, man. It's just if the armies and all those. That yeah, I didn't know how to ones. apply it. But I knew about what they ask you is like, oh, there's this story of this person. Now, hear the story of this person. What yeah, are they? Yeah, what happened? If you're thinking about it now, what are they? To me, me only five, bro, all you five need to do is take the words that you know and, and you'll be able it. to yeah. put together the story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I remember that as well. Yeah. My, my best subject was um social media. Social no, media? no, it's social studies. Social, social studies. studies. I said social, social media. Studies. Jesus. That's, that's a fact. That's a fact. Don't worry. No, no, no. Bacon. Social I'm studies. We're away from home. Biology, mathematics. I don't know. Nigerian mathematics is different from... Nigerian maths is different from UK maths. You know, in my in my like my first... I remember my first term, one of the questions was like, so the number, um, the number like let's say two thousand, let's say two thousand four hundred and thirty-two. Mm. Write that in letters. Huh? As in Roman numerals. No, no. Write like like what is this number? Like what? Like for example, like what is what is two thousand four hundred and thirty-two? So that is like two thousand four hundred and thirty-two. Oh, okay, yeah. But okay. some people would just be thinking that, oh, is it that? Like, 23,000. Do you know what I mean? That like, oh. so people didn't know. So that was one of our, that was one of the questions in first seven. But I got all of them wrong. Like. I got an F in maths. <laughs> I, can't, I know I got F so many times. Bro, like, maths called Lee, called the easy, highest, bro. I think the highest I would have gotten was like, a, there's A, B, C, there's D, I think E. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's the highest. I think. E or D. Mm. Yeah, either yeah. one of them. Before we move on though, like what's your kind of like um, Nigeria, London story? So yeah. You were bought, <laughs> bro, yeah. So yeah, so my thing, yeah. Obviously, not to make it big because of technicalities. <laughs> yeah. So I came when I was young. We were supposed to come for like a summer holiday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were supposed to come for summer holiday. Yeah. So then my mom and my aunt, she was like contemplating, like, oh yeah, like you can stay, man. Obviously, without papers, without yeah, papers, yeah, yeah. like you can stay with me. And then when he gets to a certain age, we can yeah. apply Chill for him because yeah, he's yeah. living. Yeah. And then, then I used to like football so much. And obviously, if you're going to do that, you have to, you have to be very careful. You can't be out everywhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was going like, going to play football and then I got scouted by Charlton. So oh, they wanted to like sign me and say, like, what, what's your name? Where do you leave? And my aunt was like, nah, nah. Because my aunt that time, too, she was illegal. I was like, nah, yeah, this yeah. boy is going to put me in trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dark <Send> man, man. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, nah, I can't keep hey, this boy yo, here. That is crazy. Yeah, well, like, I can't keep him. Man. It's going to get me in trouble. Because when they start asking for all these documents, yeah, and yeah, all yeah. Things, like, it will be long, man. Like, yeah, yeah so, so, yeah, so they set me back, man. I was in Nige, I was in Nige. Then I was working for a bit. I was in Nai, obviously, when uni, I went uni and I went secondary school, went uni. And then when I came out of uni, I just, then Nigeria was becoming very bad, man. So, like, five years ago, I just, I was, I just applied for the visa, man. Mm -hmm. And then I got the visa and then I just came back, man. No one even knew. Mm -hmm. <laughs> even my mom. <laughs> uh, <laughs> even my mom. Is it? Yeah, it was like, I can remember, man, it was like during COVID, I came, I took the train from... Where did I take you? From Itro, mm. just stayed with my cousin in Bermondsey. Uh -huh. And then from then, I was meant to go back, but then they did lockdown and everything. Mm. Yeah, so you just said bunny. So, and then that's when they started doing like the NSARS in yeah, Nigeria yeah, and everything. Yeah. And the economy was getting like bad. bad yeah, 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 It's just like, it's long now. So worth it, man. Yeah, no, I feel just, you, man. You're here now. So, so, you like, it, yeah, it's like, just let it, me man. just Lego stay here, man. <laughs> yeah, man. It's, uh, that's what, literally, I tried, I wanted to go back, but I just couldn't like, but then you want to go back on holiday or you feel like there's just no point for oh, now? Oh, there's no point, man. Mm. Like, Nigeria is... If you're... It's just, 
if you've lived in Nigeria, like there's like you know, PTSD. Yeah, yeah. I've yeah. been arrested by SARS. Like there's been mm. so many things that's yeah, gone yeah, on. Yeah, and yeah, just yeah. living in Nigeria. So yeah. if you're walking on the road, you have to look back. Like all those kind of things. Like mm. doesn't make sense for me, man. Yeah, I feel you, man. That's mad though. So just as a quick follow up question, then. So is it like a situation where if they know you've come from abroad, then you're okay? Or is it like it can be anyone? Because people still go to Nigeria and but have there's fun. There's no more SARS, man. Oh, fair. Yeah, there's no SARS anymore. Okay. But obviously, you still get like, there's still like rough areas where yeah. if you go like the, the area boys, mm. you yeah, still try yeah, to like, yeah, you, yeah, of allow you, you go give us something. Or, yeah, like, yeah, it's yeah, still, yeah. It's still mm-hmm. rough. Mm-hmm. But that's why when people go back, there's sort of like, they will rent like the more poles. Like, yeah, yeah. Just of course. sort of guess. That happened to us. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so we, went, we went to like... Wait, um, have, you, have you ever been Lagos? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Holiday. Yeah, yeah, yeah I've been yeah, Lagos. Yeah. I've been Isale Cool. I've Spend been in Lagos. Lagos. Yeah. I've been yeah. in Lagos yeah. Island. Like, so we went Lagos to that. We went that. Like, not a Kedra, but we went to like, the Lagos like, market, in it. So we were walking now. Me, Timbo, Mitch, Charles, my, all, all my brothers were walking. And like, obviously, like, I'm, I'm wearing a vest. You can see my tattoos. My hair is different. Mm. Timbo's got like, his hair, tattoos on his back. Like, everyone, Mitch got tattoo on his shoulder. My brother's got tattoos. So they could just thinking, nah, these are definitely not. So people just started following us. Mm. So I'm following us. They're following us this now. But late. No, no, this is that broad day. Bro, this is that. So any time, yeah. bro. But when they're following jungle. us now, they're not trying to hurt us. They're trying to be security. Mm. So because they, 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 we're going to give their money at the end. We have to. Like, even if we don't want them, that like, we're saying, bro, we're good. They're like, no, you're not good. Like they're following us nah, everywhere. Bro, um, Went to a shop. They're following us to the shop. Like it's and the same then, way. It's the same way how it works at the airport. You don't need them. To yeah, yeah. Help you with stuff, but it'll help you. Like, yeah, so you can make money. Yeah. But like, yeah. So that's what they done to us, bro. Like there was, and we had to give them peace. There was like mm. five, six of them following us everywhere. Like the Christmas I spent in Lagos before I came. You know what happened? Yeah, I was me and my friend was going to an event like mm. in December. That's the only thing about mm-hmm. Lagos, man. December is fucking mm-hmm. lit. Man. So yeah, we're going in London. Shit, dog shit, <laughs> like Christmas period. <laughs> but in Lagos, bro, you're outside every day, mm. and they will, even at work, they will allow you to come late to work the next day, like because mm. they know like Christmas period, my mm. everyone's outside. Mm. I was driving, driving now, tires gone, mm. parked by the side of the road. These guys come insisting, like, yo, let me help you, let me help, like, bro, we can do it. Mm. Let me help, let me help. Then when he's finished helping us. Okay, fine, we'll give you like two hundred naira. Just okay, mm. thank you. Like, no, lie, lie. 1,000 lower me, that kind of thing. I was like, bro. And before me and my guy knew it, my man's already signal, signaling goons. And wow, wow, best song. Whoa. And he was like, <laughs> it was a secluded area. Bro, imagine that kind of thing happening to you. That's why I said, man, <laughs> fuck this place, man. I'm not coming back. You know the funniest thing is as well in those situations? Can't do anything. If you bro, run, what can you, what are you gonna do? You're like, done. You gonna your How can you lose for something you just ask for? <laughs> yeah. Are you going to leave your car? You can't leave your car, bro. And that time yeah, it was my uh, mom's car. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. Hey, 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 yo. Hey, if hey, I leave, hey, you're nah, nah, I tell you what the situation reminds me of. <laughs> bro. Have, you seen, have you seen the young video? At Nando's? Yeah, yeah, oh, hey, yeah. Like, when the guy, yeah, hey, when the guy said, hey, you, man, come. <laughs> hey, and bro... I don't get onto him the way people run, run bro. bro. Why are you staying? I'm running. I'm running, bro. If, the, if someone car. says, of course you are. So but bro, you just have to make sure you have your keys in yeah, it. But, but they will smash bro. it up. Yeah, 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 They will take stuff out of your car. Yeah, yeah, so it's just 100%. better to just fair me. Just fair me. Pay man. Life is for living, bro. But that's the thing about some people though, like... You pay the 1K, but where does it end though? Like, do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying? So there's like... You gotta be firm though. Yeah, when yeah. I went, when bro, I you went, can't. No, no, don't do that, man. Don't you, get, bro? You can't be firm. No, but that. sometimes you, no. Okay, for example, I'm talking about this scenario. Yeah, no, 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 no. I'm saying no, 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 that like I went to. You be firm with area boys, bro. Before you know bro, it, they will bust bust on your head. When I went to, I went lucky. When I went in 2020, I went lucky, yeah. And then um, we were on like we were on like like a like a merry go round, didn't it? Yeah. But there's no electric, so he was doing the merry go round manually. He <laughs> so he was moving it, moving it, moving it. He said, so people were getting on it because it's still fun because it's like it wasn't a lot of people, so he was just spinning it in his hands. So we're actually going round, didn't it? So everyone was giving money. He was at, he was at, I was at, yeah, who's that? Did you try? You done the first season? Yeah. First. Um, eight thousand naira, eight thousand naira. I was like, "Are you insane, bro?" Like, eight, eight K. He said, "He said eight K, eight K." He said, "Bro, I'm not playing with you." I said, "Bro, don't get me mad right now, bro." I said, "I said no one's got eight K for you." Like he was like, "Eight K, eight K." I said, "You got two K, take it." Uh, that was five hundred naira ride. Right? Yeah, yeah. Do you yeah, get right. me? So he's bargained his way, but I said, "You know what? Cool, just take it." But you're not taking eight K from me. What if I said, "Okay, cool, like eight K"? Like, bro, you got when when you guys went by, did they make fun of like your accent? Oh, what? Yes. See, that's the that's the funniest. <laughs> you thing, said you though. didn't get that, innit? They loved it. 
Nah, no. Nah. Like, at first. No, no, no. Even at first, bro. Like, it's like you're different, basically. No, so at they, first they loved it. I said after they oh, were. Oh, after they me. were getting onto you. Yeah, oh, they never got onto me. I felt yeah, like, like that's what made me like. It's because yours is Lagos in like Potako and stuff like that. Abuja. More, Abuja, yeah. There's, I'll say there's something like. <sighs> Lagos people. It's the same with London people. But I didn't go to a school that had people like I was the only person that same, had come from a, like somewhere abroad. When I was in Abuja, even though it was an international school, they always say international school. It's not it's really international. <laughs> like, do you know what I mean? To make the Agda school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, no, literally. Yeah, it's just to make the, the school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no facts. So, um, yeah, like, so literally, it wasn't like I had anyone else there. Like, but the experience was different. Like, people loved it. Maybe it's because like my mum was like uh, a big person on the school like oh but i was known do you know what i mean what was your mom's job bro no 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 she didn't um work in the school in it like just she you know the auntie that everyone knows yeah there's oh, boys okay. with all the teachers and boys with all yeah, the teachers yeah, yeah. boys with the head teacher yeah like, yeah tight. yeah because she um sells clothes in it yeah like, okay, she makes so her clothes and sells it in it yeah. and she would have a lot of business with the teachers, with the head yeah, teacher in yeah. school. Uh, basically so, community. Exactly. Yeah. So everyone knew her. So maybe that was what nah, helped me. Really and then football as well. Like, That's what know, I was about to say. Good, like, when it was who, time... Who's better? Come Tell on. the truth. <laughs> He's better. <laughs> Stop He's it. He's better right now. What are you talking about? We don't He's, play football you right might, now. Why no, no, keep saying that though? Bro, I don't have to tell him. Even right now. Even right now. Why do you keep saying Even right now. You're not better than me, bro. You're not better than me, bro. You're not better than me. You keep saying that. You're not better than me, I am, I am, bro. You can't run at your peak. At your peak, he came to you better than me. No, both of you at your peak. Nah. Don't forget about I think. I think what I will say with him. Look at what he's saying. I think now. No, no, what I will say. Look at how it's No, no, listen to me. I don't play football. Right now, I'm better than you. Oh, yeah, cool. That's you, Do you know what? You can have them. Because I don't play football. I only play goals every other day, like if I can. Like, And it's not even, I said every other day. Goals once a week if we can. It's no problem. Yeah, you can be better than me. You can have that. At our peak. At our peak, who's better? Wait, wait. Stop waiting. Just answer the question the way you said. Stop what I will say. What I will say. Just ask him yes or no. Well, see, we literally played for the same club. Said, you no, said yes. Exactly. No, why are you changing it? Exactly. Thank you. This is a, this is not. I remember who was better. This, yes. is, this is not a podcast. That three of, this, there's people watching this. So what I, I say to RP. all of the kids watching this outside. Yeah, RP, my advice is always have confidence. If you don't have confidence in this football RP. thing, it will hold you back. RP. I believe ability wise, I was better than Bear Man. But I, unfortunately, uh, if I didn't, without confidence, it was never able to show. So at our peak, I have to say that. What kind of explanation is? I have to say that you were better than me. You got more stats. This isn't December where you need to do the Queen speech or anything like that, bro. It's one question. G, you're not all that, it's bro. Like, yes, you're not all I that. definitely was, bro. No, he wasn't, I bro. scored one of the craziest goals for you're his club. That. You're yeah. not all that. <laughs> like, yeah, and so then the league. Do you yeah. know what he said to me? And this is the day I knew, yeah, that, you know, because man, them, like, you know when it comes to, like, FIFA and, like, all it's these ego. things... It's ego, of course. <laughs> I'm not, I don't have Hold ego, though. You know that I have ego. Let me be honest with you, yeah. Because I've played both. I've played... um, What's the league below National League? Um, Is this careful? I played just the league... Be below yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I, play, I, play, I play Kent level county football. Yeah, so yeah. I've also played that level. But um, just if say, you're if you're better on, than you, you say like hold no. on, let me let me because talk. I know like regardless of any time. Just, rem just, remember, <laughs> just remember my highest level was Kent level county level. Kent County Prem you know or which one? No, 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 no anyone not Kent Prem. So anyone could have played. Nah. Not anyone can play Ken County Prem. Not anyone not can play. Any, are you hearing what you're saying? Not anyone can, can play Ken County Prem. Well, He's not like, played. I could have played This Ken. is how you know he I hasn't played, played that Ken level because ease. when you get to that level, this isn't like Sel Kent where you get in and So where did it go? Accepted. Where did it go? Why don't you have no, it anymore? Not, that's not, not the point. You just said class permanent. Hey, can you let me land? Can you let me land? What I'm saying is, what I mean by class permanent is, in terms of ability, I know that any day, any time, even if I stop playing football, if I if I get if I was to come back and yeah. I didn't take a seriously, oh, I, that yeah. would be, like, that would be better than me. I said, <laughs> no, then do it. Old. Then do it. Do it, it, bro. For what? What do you mean? Why not? I don't want to be why not? That's, that's, that's my point. That's, what do you mean by? Why would anymore. you not want to? Who would not want to actively play football, bro? I, bro, because I'm one of the, I'm one of the most busiest time. guys ever, bro. I yes, so am I. So am I. I still, but I still take time out to play, bro. And I love the game. You play more than You're not better than you're not better. You're not better than me, bro. And you know you already admit it. So why are you going back on your words now? I'm not going back on my words. Going back on my word. Where, when did you guys meet? Listen, listen, listen. Wait, let me go, go, hold go, on. Go, go, let go. me land. This is what we're in the whole thing. Right, cool. This is what we're in the whole thing. Let land. This is what we're in the whole thing. Listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's part of me, man. It's part of me, bro. bro. It's why we're here. It's exactly why we're here. Finally have a platform to settle this once and for all. This is how I know. And you know when there's ego, it's pride when it comes to things like FIFA and all these things, like admitting who's the best at certain things. Bro, and at the end of the day, I love the fact that 
man them want to be the bro everyone wants to be the best do you know what i'm saying why not why should and if you believe you're the best who is anyone to tell you that you're not the best of course you should argue if you've got the points just like he was talking about with his confidence point cool the day i knew he respected me and knew that i was better is the day he put he and i'll never forget this to the day i die and if, if i'm lying god strike me down he pulled you already he, I, I he, I yeah, he pulled me to the side and said daniel you're sick, bro. <laughs> like, you're actually it's sick. Great. And, and look, look, look. It's, it's not even... A, we can have the argument now. The argument can carry on from now till tomorrow. All I know is that I have that. And it's not to use it over your head. It's just the point that I know when we've had a serious conversation about yeah. this football conversation, yeah. that is his opinion of me. So and what, I, it's not to say that I think you need play. I was a centre mid, innit? A striker centre mid, but mainly centre mid. I play left wing and up front. Well, I don't think you'll ever be settled. Bro. It will never be settled, man. But it, you is know, settled. it is settled. It's not, it's he was not. better then, I'm better than you now. It's as simple so as peaks, that. So. Peaks. It's not about peaks. No one cares though. about right it's now. It's not about peaks. What no one about cares peaks? about right where now. Where did your peak get you? That's not the peak. That's not <laughs> well, the peak. My peak got me to like, Kent, Kent level team. No, it don't mean nothing. You still done it for fun. Because at the end of the day, you didn't No, no, no. At the time, at the time, I was like, at the time, I was still, I was still trying to make it. Oh, okay. At the time, I still was. Kent Premier Series. But then, when I stopped it playing Kent football Kent seriously, Kent, Kent, just Kent. No, Kent Lee, yeah. Kent Prem is different, isn't it? Kent Prem is when you get to like, when you're, you're actually playing semi-pro. Yeah, 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 yeah. But Kent is like, Wait, at what age was this? This was, this like was 16. 16. Oh, okay, 16, that's a yeah. long time ago. Exactly. No, but, <laughs> no, but that's the I'm level. I'm talking about like adult men's football. Uh, uh, it's what I'm saying, it's what I'm saying right no, now. No, 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 no one, but, none of our friends can hang with me, bro. Because no one, no one, no, no one, one can, plays no one can, no one, but no one plays football. My point is, I'm talking about men's football, bro. This is me, but what's men's football? I don't play men's football. Men's football is, I'll say, 21 plus, yeah, like, 21 yeah, like plus. 20, 21 you're plus. That's what I'm saying. Then I'm you're, still not, I'm from the, I am. The point, the point is, the point is, if we played, if we all took it seriously, and let's say we all wanted to get back into men's football now, like I'm from now. You're not, you're not touching listen, me, bro. You're if not we, if we all went gyms, played football, practiced again, tried to get to the level that we needed to get to, to play men's football, bro, you know what's happening. No, I do, I do know what's truth. happening. You're right. I'm, I'm, I do I'm, know what's happening. I'm going to be playing at a better level. You're, you're, I, I can put on anything I know I love and play in the I can put anything I know I love and put it. You can't, like, even when we play now, like, bro, put all the man in. Put all the man in, put all the man in, put all the man in. Whenever we went, When was the last time we played together? It's been a while, bro. Exactly. When we went, goals, put all the man in there. I wasn't there. Just bear that in mind. No one could outrun me on the pitch. Just bear in mind, I wasn't there. No one's quicker than me on the ball. Allow it, man. All you had over me was strength. That's it. But it's not too good It's not too good Anyway, let's carry on, man. Let's talk about that. From there, let's go to Nigeria. That you need to go see. That you need to go see as well. Uh, yeah, man. Yeah, but know, go ahead. But go ahead. We, we just talk about Nigerian football. Uh, I'm not like. Was debate. it the last Nations Nations Cup? You did like an interview with BBC Radio. Yeah, yeah. Was yeah. it the last Nations Cup? Yeah, like, literally. Yeah. Yeah. So on BBC Radio Five Live. I did that. A talk with them on like the African Cup of Nations. It was good. What mm. did we play? Did we play in the last Nations Cup? The Nigerian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did. We lost. We, to, got, we lost to Morocco. Morocco. Is it two? Oh no, yeah. No, no, Algeria. Is it Morocco? Algeria. No, it wasn't Algeria. That was the. African Cup of Nations. It was Mahrez, though, I swear. No, that was the African Cup of Nations before that. In okay, the okay, okay. We lost. Yeah, to, I, know, I remember the semis. We lost to Morocco, Tunisia, 1 0. 1 0. Yeah, 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 I remember. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They scored in the first it half and Morocco. then they locked up. The yeah, game. we just. Yeah, yeah. Couldn't. Was it Morocco or Tunisia? I literally just escaped my mind. I think it was Tunisia. It's one of it's one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what do you guys Tunisia. think of Nigerian football now? Obviously, you have to be impartial, isn't it? Because one of our guys is holding it down for us. <laughs> Usta, I'm um, Brian. Brian. Yeah, yeah, one of our boys. Friend, but yeah. over, I no, I mean, when it comes to players, we've always had players. Yeah. it's just like an overall picture. Just Should I tell like, you one problem with Nigerian football is we don't have good coaches. Facts. We do not have good coaches. Simple as got all the international ballers, bro. Get a coach. You could put a structure together. Bro, I've let me between like a lot of people, I've spoken to a lot of the players on the team and like I've heard stories, bro, coaches. I heard like um so the guy who was the manager before, this guy called Austin Aguevon. Yeah. Apparently he used to tell the man them just go out and play, work hard, like like it's not tactically I mean? no structure. Teach. No bro, no structure, bro. Like when you're you're losing okay, perfect example is the game that pisses me off the most, and that's why I hate watching Nigeria sometimes because I'm so much more invested than I am yeah, when I'm watching England, innit? But it actually gets me mad. Like, things like, you're facing Ghana, yeah, in a qualifiers. Cool, first leg, nil-nil. Whatever happens, happens. Second leg, yeah, they score a long-range goal. Party scores a long-range goal where the keeper drops it into the net. You're dominating the game. <laughs> F like change things. <laughs> you're like you know when you're in the ascendancy. Wait, who was the coach then? We I it was still going on. That's when he got when sacked. Did, when when did we have the foreign coach? We Pereira. Foreign coach he came after the World Cup qualifiers when we didn't get into the World Cup. 
Okay. That's when Pereira is coming. Did but you even win the Nations Cup? Who? Like Pereira. Pereira. No, no, no. Okay, okay. So we're trying to qualify for the Nations Cup now. I don't think we've even got a manager yet. Because Pereira got sacked. He got sacked. Yeah, 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 yeah I know yeah. he got sacked. Yeah. So, it's, it's not Pereira, Pasero. Pasero, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bro, they Pacero. always make fun of him, man. Uh-huh. <laughs> like, yeah. I, he was supposed to come in and be like different, but he just wasn't. The last good outcome one. was in 2013, isn't it? No, no. Oh, we won. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 2013. Yeah, man. 2012. So we beat Ivory Coast. 2013. Uh, Sunday Umba. Sunday Umba. Sunday Umba. Yeah, yeah Umba. Yeah. Yeah. Good squad, volley though. still. <laughs> terrible bully man he's, if you look oh, at man. him he's a very terrible player he's not pleasing that's to harsh, the that's eye that's Mbar Bro, Mbar wasn't bad he wasn't oh, bad no, but after, the, after that Nations Cup he got his move man <laughs> to where where is St- he now I think it was it was, was Prem innit he was one of nah, the no no Prem no, prem, prem, no way he was in Prem was it Mbar Mbar what country is Mbar from Nigeria I'm trying to think no but what player am I I, mean, I think it was Stoke because check 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 I think it was Stoke he got his move what's his name what's his first name Sunday Mbar Sunday Sunday Obviously, there's a Nations Cup next year, and we have. I think right now, we are, we have play out players like talent wise. Do you guys think we have the best, like the best team? Because before it used to be Nigerians competing, trying to like match up with the Europeans. Still think Ghana's now, got a really good team, better than Nigeria. <sighs> no, he didn't come prem. He didn't come. No, prem. he never went prem. I think he, I yeah, said championship. He went Rangers. Oh, he went oh. Rangers. Who was the one that went championship with Stoke? He went Stoke City, the midfielder. Onazi. Was it Onazi? Onazi yeah. played for Lazio. He didn't go Stoke. But Onazi played for Stoke later. Oh, Onazi did. Who Onazi. Ma- he played for Lazio and Stoke. Onazi played for Stoke Yeah, later. yeah, yeah. It was Onazi. Onazi was decent as well. It was all right. It was all right. Nothing too special, but... So what do you guys think next year, Nations Cup? Where do you guys think we'll finish? I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm not bothered. <laughs> Is it a fan. table? It's a group a table. Table. A that's table, it. Yeah. He played, and he also played for Watford, I think, as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Table. And, that's uh, it. Obviously, Victor. Let's see what Victor can do for us. That's it, man. Isn't it? It's good for Nigeria. You, could, yeah, <laughs> you guys, it's the best thing. You yeah. guys pull up. You guys pull up. The, I mean, Musa is meant to be jailed, man. He scored only eighteen goals in one of the seven. Senior man. But again, though, like <laughs> I'm, I'm sure you guys might, have, or if you didn't know this, you'll probably know this, but like. Again, a major issue about Nigerian football is the same thing that happens in the country. Like, there's politics, bro. Mm. Yeah, man. Like, so, for example, with Ahmed Musa, you have to pick him because you need someone to... the Northerners. Exactly. You need someone to represent the North. You need someone to represent the South. It's the same way, like, with the presidency. They like to rotate it with Yoruba, Mm. then Mm. an Igbo Mm. man, then a a Hausa man. Yeah, Rotate it like that. Do you know what I'm saying? Because you need to appease all sides or Nigeria will just beef. And that's the problem now that we have, like guys like Igalo still getting call ups late. Is he into still his getting career. Call up? Not now, anyway. But but Musa still gets called up. To Musa when? was getting called up when he didn't have a team. No, it, what up? It was just more of like it's like really training with England. Yeah, like, no, but he played in games. He played in the friendly games. or a qualifier. He played in one of the qualifiers. Jesus Christ, bro! bro. Musa was getting caps. too many players for. The I thought Musa was hard though. He was though. The nah, World Cup. Th- yeah, that World Cup. That World Cup. Oh, yeah. That 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 was. He, he made us have one of the like that was one that of was the best World Cups ever. Yeah. Twenty fourteen yeah. or twenty eighteen? Twenty fourteen by far. Twenty eighteen was very. Twenty fourteen is what country? Brazil. Yeah, yeah. Not twenty fourteen. Twenty. Twenty fourteen was Brazil. Twenty eighteen. Twenty eighteen was Russia. Was Russia where we played um Argentina? Argentina yeah, Iceland. yeah, yeah. Argentina. Eighteen was better. I mean, we've had Argentina. Better, we've had Argentina in our group for the past. But then no, f- for the past fourteen four years. though was when we had France in the round of sixteen. Yeah, and they beat. And we were bad. Fourteen. Yeah. yeah. 14. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah, we weren't yeah. bad that year either. Because we qualified with Argentina, innit? In 14. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. In 14. Wait. In but I, stage, I think I preferred 18. Even though we went out in the group stages. It was better. We played better yeah. in 18. In 14, what did we play in the group stages? It was like, it was like, a, it was like, a, like a, a dead country, then a decent country, then and Argentina. then Argentina. But I know I 18, we beat Iceland. Beat Iceland. Argentina beat us. Then we drew. Drew to Croatia. Croatia, yeah. That was a good draw. Then we drew with Croatia. Talk, then we lost to Argentina. Argentina was the last game. I remember it was a holiday. No, no, yeah, no. It was, no. It was, we, it was. Beat, we beat Iceland. Yeah, Argentina was the last game. Remember, because Argentina yeah. needs to win. And we needed to win. Whoever won was getting through. It was one Croatia. Croatia, Croatia won the group. And Rojo scored yeah, the last one in the header. Yeah, 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 Croatia yeah, yeah. won the group. Wait, which one did Messi score in? Messi 20, scored in 20, all of them. But he scored in 2014. There's one that was very iconic. 2014. He scored in every group game. In 2014. 2014, yeah, the one where he took the on his knee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the one that we're not, they're not, bro, I'll but yeah. look everything up, bro. Yeah. Good walk up, yeah, man. Yeah, cool. All right. Um, Dan. I'm going to head out. Yeah, man. Come on, man. Love, love, love. Appreciate it. Good conversation, we'll man. 
Yeah. We'll be back. We'll be back. We'll be back. I'm going to say we didn't settle the conversation. He's still reeling from the football. Yeah, no, no. He's dropping football. Yeah, I'm up. No, 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 no. But I'll see Three you guys pounds, later, yeah? Three, Three pounds. pounds. Guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Mm-hmm. And yeah, please like, comment, and, like and subscribe at least, even if you don't want to comment. And Lego Smiths London is sponsored by Tasty African Food. Tasty African Food, they've got outlets all around Southeast London. They have one outlet in North London now. They're extending to Birmingham and, yeah, the Midlands, basically. And they're available on Uber Eats. All right, back to the conversation, my bro. Hey, <laughs> Kamzo, the flyest. <laughs> yeah, you know, man. Do you think, do you really think you're the flyest? I don't think no one can touch me, so I'll be Hey, right. come on. Hey, what was cold, man? What are you, what are you worth a penny up? Are you, cold? Can you imagine, bro? You well, think anyone could clean, pull something like that out? Easy, man. It's different, man. It's too easy. I need How some was that, like, How was what? Penny, penny up? up? Yeah, man. Not even, like... I know you already spoke about the like you going for the audition and it was just like yeah just, yeah like, yeah. You, I feel like you carried the movie. I was gonna say it went down was yeah. Uh, but obviously we got lost. In, yeah, I feel like you carried that. No, no, I appreciate it, man. Penny up. It was it, it was, was good. stressful mentally. It was very like, stressful, man. Mentally, it weren't easy. Yeah, it weren't easy. Like it went it went it went hard, but it went as easy as people think. Like it took a lot. It took a lot of actually like actual planning, a lot of trying things, not feeling it, then feeling it. Like there was a couple lines that I was doing, that I just couldn't get into. You know, and it took some time to actually get into. So it was it was an experience. It was a proper experience, man. It was really good, and the premiere just made it even better. Like seeing everyone come down, like seeing you there, the people that it was crazy because a lot of people that I didn't expect to see were actually there. So that's why for me it was like, wow, okay, like this is insane. Those come to see me act. Can you imagine? Like, so yeah it was sick how did you find the film uh, bro the film was very good man I loved it mm-hmm. honestly man yeah mm. that's why I said I feel like you carried the film it was mm. just I feel the character you, that you depicted mm-hmm. in the movie was sort of sort of like my character mm-hmm. like, that's mm-hmm. how, I was, how I was in school mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. I could just relate yeah yeah yeah, yeah. and I also like the um, a person that's big on friendships like, yeah yeah to, yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. No, of course of course of yeah of course yeah. it's important man I like the story and yeah, it was well put together. Very. The girl that wrote it, Stoney, man, she's amazing. She's good at what Stoney, she does. Star Stoney, man. Girl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Stoney, Stoney is hard. Yeah, Stoney, Stoney fine girl. <laughs> so how did you, how did you guys, how did you guys come up with the, like, when did you guys decide to start the podcast, Send Back? Send Back podcast. And how did you and Dan even meet? So me and Dan met in school. Um, me and Dan's met in, yeah, so obviously Daniel, I joined my secondary school in year nine. He joined it in year 10. Which one's that? It's Woolwich Poly. Oh. So it's in that Woolwich Thamesmead area. Uh-uh. Um, yeah, yeah, now. that's that's the that's full of Na- Thamesmead full of Nigerians. <laughs> that's where that's where I beast that and Peckham. But um, so we met in school now, just cool. Didn't really talk about us being both being sent back. We just were just friends. And then obviously as we was going about, me and Daniel were very vocal people. Like we, we both did drama. Like we were always vocal people. Played football together. We won tournaments together for the form. It was in the same form group. And then I think um in year eleven now, Daniel even forgot, so I reminded him. Our head of year made us host our prom, our graduation. So me and Daniel had to host it. Like we were basically like the MCs for the day. So that's just an example. But we didn't see it as anything then. We we're just like, oh, okay, they chose us, cool. But when you look back on it now, it's like all of these things were written. God already knew. Like it was us as people. So when time was going by, Daniel, you know, Daniel does sports. I do music. And we just thought that we want to come together. We didn't know how. Like me and Daniel were sitting on sitting on us working together for like a year, you know, just sitting on what could it be? Just sitting, just not rushing anything, like just sitting down, what could it be? And I said, you know what? Why didn't we do a podcast on being sent back, you know, from Nigeria? Like it was like, that's such a good idea. I said, yeah, there's not a lot of podcasts like that. We have so many stories, we can bring on so many guests. Me and Daniel are so different in character as well. Like, you know me, yeah, I'm very I, like I used to I used to think, oh, we're not not on film now and I yeah, know that yeah. you guys are so you're very very different yeah 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 <laughs> no yeah, yeah, different. Conversation yeah, yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. like we can both be very like huh, and both be very but normally it's like I'm normally that kind of guy he's normally very relaxed and stuff yeah, like yeah. so we're different in character that's why we get on so well that so yeah man that's just been it and just been onwards and upwards since man it's been good, and good, you good guys run. did two seasons in one year I was two listening seasons, yeah, yeah, like, wow, yeah, that's, yeah two seasons that's in one a lot year of work, 10 episodes man. a season it's not easy at it's all not easy, shout man. out to London Podcast Studios man for shout allowing London us to do what we do there man yeah, but yeah man. nah seriously it, it's not easy but we just gotta keep pushing I guess and keep pushing man when I look at you guys I think yeah man it's sick and it's good way everyone's coming together because yeah, it's dope. It's sort of it's when to, when I saw you guys page on Instagram. Yeah, when did you when first see us? Page, when did you first see us? Bro, I don't. Need, that's why Instagram is is such a powerful tool, man. Mm-hmm. Like when I saw the page, and then the first thing I saw was the 
the um the the sitcoms the Nigerian sitcoms. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. This is so this sick. This is a man. super story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Really I think I remember you commenting on that. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, all right, this is like you know the Spider Man meme. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is really such a sick idea. We came together and did an episode. Yeah, which is was very nice. And yeah, another thing I like about you guys' podcast, I always say like, if you're gonna start a podcast. Make sure you have a team, mm. and just because you have a team, there's sort of sort of like a direction, Structure, and yeah. then you can keep yeah. building on that. Yeah, yeah, that. for real, for real. Yeah, what do nah. you think? With, I know it's such a challenge question. Where do you see yourself in the next? What, what challenges? What's your like biggest challenge? With, I think the, I think the podcast. The biggest challenge is consistency. Consistency is always hard. Like now, it's work for me now, isn't it? I've been doing it for so long that I don't see it as extracurricular like it's work like it may not pay me directly but it's through doing it that I get paid in other ways so in hindsight it's work for me now so and you don't always want to go to work no matter what job you're doing even if you're a footballer you don't wake up every morning wanting to play the days you just want to stay at home and sleep so you know like like for example we're recording this week this week coming alone I've got something to shoot on Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Saturday and Sunday so I have seven days I have five shoots on top of my regular nine to five job you know so like do you get me? That's how life can get. And of course, you it's still fun. have to edit. I still have to. We don't edit, but like we have a say in editing. We we like they might edit a reel, but I might edit on top because I like my things on point. The certain things I want, so they will edit. I will edit on top. So it's very busy. You know, I'm doing my own stuff as well. Like going to wireless, and I edit all of that. Those kind of things. So it's 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 that's the only challenge. But I feel like overall, because I'm hungry for it there's nothing that can really stand in my way. Like I might go through spurts where I'm just like Ugh, tired, but God will always like, just give me a kick on the backside and something will come my way that will ignite the fire again. Cause I feel like of recently I felt on it, like coming home from a long day of work, bringing out my tripod, shooting something when I should normally just be resting. You know, the momentum is there. So it's about just keeping it going, to be honest. And it's a testament to the hard work because if you can do 20 episodes in a year that's mm. it's, not it's not easy, easy man. it's not easy it's not easy it's not easy, it's not easy. It's not, and it's not like it's not paying you directly mm. but mm. you're still saying like yeah we need, we're doing we need this. it yeah. yeah i was I, my saying is like if you want to be a superstar you have to act like it so me and daniel like, let me know we'll have arguments like, i'll be that to him you're not acting like a superstar yet you're seeing this as what it is you're looking at the views and you're looking at the like because if you don't act like a superstar, when you then have superstar things to do, you won't be ready for it. So for example, like if we're going to say we're going to drop on this day, drop on this day. If you Go. say you're going to do something, do something like, you know, be on time and record and have like revert, rehearse your topics, rehearse the yeah, editing, you yeah. know, treat it like as a business because one day Supermark might come to us and say, yeah, we want to sponsor this episode for 10K and they sponsor it now. We can't now say that we forgot something because that now affects the money. So I'm saying that's how you should act like you're being sponsored, act like it's paying you before you start getting paid. So that way you'll be ready. So that's why I always tell people like, don't do the bare minimum in this life. Always do the maximum, do the most. Do you know what I mean? When I went to wireless, I had a road mic. Everybody is doing road mics now, doing the little street interviews and stuff. They had they just have their road mic. Me, I got the mic flag, put my logos on it, bow, 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 bow. Yeah, yeah. So everyone looking at me like, yeah, like, everywhere. Yeah, everyone yeah. looking at me like, bro, how did you get that done? Like, oh, that's sick. Like, how did you do that? I'm just like, yeah, because I want you to. When I go to people, it looks official. Like, what is this? Like, okay, this looks real. Let me talk to him. Do you know what I mean? You have yeah. to separate yourself no matter how you can. And that's why, even like, look at this, all of this stuff you have going around. Not a lot of podcasts. Some podcasts will just sit in a space like this, but our camera go. That's okay with them, but all of these little things, you will be surprised. That's what will make you different from other podcasts, bro. Yeah, that's what I was literally, I always say to my co-host too, even mm. if we're running late, make sure you put up the, even if we can really record for 30 minutes. Do boy, it. Make sure you put it up because it's just, it shows you're putting in effort, it's branding mm. and it's not just, uh, let's just sit down and talk. Man. Mm. There's a lot of the small, tiny bits that yeah. has to go in. Go yeah. in and it's obviously... It's a very competitive space we're in right now. Mm -hmm. It's very, very competitive. Yeah, man. Who, who is you say? Uh, you mentioned you've been going to like events ar around and uh, yeah. what's your song of the summer? My song of this summer, Afrobeats or overall? Just one each. One each. My Afrobeats song of the summer. It's a deep question, man. My favorite or what's the song? Are you asking my personal favorite? What's your personal? If you. My personal favorite, favorite song, song of the summer. My personal favorite song of the summer that I've heard this Afrobeat wise this year is between Aquafina and Reason. But in terms of like Jaye Jaye, like if you're outside, if I wanna, I wanna dance. Yeah. 
Oh, but it came out last year. That's the thing. But nah, man, this, year, this man. year, like probably like probably two thirty, two thirty. No, probably at my piano. And my piano gets me going still. When I hear that outside, I want to move. That my piano and um and M M Nike. Nika. Oh yeah, that song. Nika. That song is good. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah Everyone is taking a... that Taliban song, but I don't think it's all that. <laughs> I think it's just the beginning. It's just man, the, for yeah, me. that's yeah. it. It's just it's not a bad song. It's just but... the intro. No. no. That's it. What about you? I'll say alphabets. It would be um What's up, my G? I'm young, wild, I'm free. I spend money like I'm a young guy, like G. I'm a oh, Okay. What's up, my okay, G? Okay, what's up, my G? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah what's yeah, up, yeah. my G? And yeah. obviously, the Minika is sort of like, it's yeah, become like yeah. an anthem. Anthem. Yeah. It's a very nice song. The beat but overall, it would, it would be like Sprinter. I like Sprinter. That's my man. song of the summer as well. Like, I I'm like Sprinter, man. On Tuesday, I've got a shoot with Link Up. Swear. Um, to discuss, yeah, Link Up TV to discuss um, split decisions, innit? And. Flash is oh. gonna be there. Nah, he done he done it already. He done it for J House's yeah, thing. I saw yeah, that so one. I'm going to the sprint on Tuesday, and I can't wait because I'm just gonna talk because them them lot. I feel they it's give mad. enough props because they're so young and because it's been such a short time. But nobody has done what they've done, bro. Nobody. Central C was in at homecoming, bro. I saw him in the first time I ever saw him perform was in Nigeria. Can you imagine? Swear, swear, bro. They won. Yeah, bro. They, he was at homecoming last year. Swear down. Swear down, bro. That's the first time I ever saw him perform. They brought him to homecoming. Shut down yeah, the it would, whole concert. It would be, Everyone it would was be singing. Like, it, would be, it, would it was be. ah, come here, man, issues. I don't need that, bro. Oh, my, was bro. It, was it down. last year or the year before? 2022. Was it TikTok? 20, what? Um, um, oh, that was Day in the Life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, Day in the, the Life of 2021. Yeah. 2021, 2020, yeah. Bro, he shut down Nigeria, bro. This year, they brought J.O. But 2022, him, R.D., Black Sheriff brought yeah. Ardi at a homecoming. It was lit. Yeah, man. I'll, he's the hardest. He's hard. So do you think this is like his cotton call? Summer. On, on always, start? Yeah. No, no, I'm saying for Whiskey himself. Do you think is, this is now like... Oh. After after this, like this is just his peak. He's going to retire. I would say the biggest... his What happened... Because he hasn't sold out to Tottenham yet. You know, right? You know that, right? I know. Even, Bo even, up... even Bonaboy didn't sell out yeah, on know, that know, same day. Know, like, yeah, he sold lied. out on that just, day. Yeah, you just, they, gave, they gave out a lot of free tickets. Like... <laughs> So, but uh, whiskey one. Yeah, from yeah. No, it's the truth. <laughs> it's the truth. <laughs> That's why I say to people, it's like, oh, he sold that. Oh, they sold that. like, bro, yeah, they, they give out loads of tickets, tickets, like labels tickets, and stuff, PR yeah, people. Man. They give out loads, bro. But um, um, whiskey's one is worse because whiskey actually has it. Like they're giving out. They're actually literally giving out free tickets online. Like people are getting it online. Like it's insane. So with him, his issue was one: you done too many shows in the O2. Anyone would because they want to make money, but you done three in it that like everyone has seen you like mo I saw you twice out of three days. Secondly, your album wasn't that great to then off the back of that doing a stadium. If he'd done a stadium for Made in Lagos, he would have sold it out a long time ago. A long time ago. Yeah. But because this wasn't this album wasn't that good, you ain't got no popularity. It's like Burner Boy. Burner Boy done African Giant, but COVID hit. Then he brought out then he brought out then he brought out um twice, twice as tall. Yeah. Tried to do the O two. He couldn't sell out the O two. He struggled. And then they they sold it out like just like what they always the say, thing, sell it yeah. out. Then he brought out the new album and then he done a stadium. And of course, because the new album was amazing. So that's how it goes. You just got to be very So do you think be for Whiskey, because like, when was the last Whiskey, I was thinking to myself today, when was the last time I actually listened to a Whiskey song? That's not like a throwback. When was the last Whiskey song you listened to? On the album, there's a couple of good songs. Um, uh, um, him, Nara Mali, Skeptical, I like that song. I like... There's, there's a few other songs I like, but overall, they're not, none of them are special songs. I don't listen to them on a regular basis. None of them were standout songs. Do you know what I mean? So do you think this is like his cotton call from like the main Nah, stage? it's not. He can always resurrect himself because he's really talented, but he well, just needs to, he needs to just sit back and just think. Everyone can do it. Burner Boy fell off and fell back on. If people happens to be David O fell off and fell back on to some people. So yes, he can do it, but I just think he needs to make it a bit more gritty again. He's very... He needs to get the hunger back. Yeah, he's too, he's too soulful with it right now. We want the... Shout out to my real niggas. Right now we get bigger. Oh, that's what uh, the whiz, whiz was cold, man. Whiz ah, was ah cold. that's what he was. Whiz. Big whiz. That was just small whiz, bro. But yeah, man. Good times, man. Good All times. Right. I, I think you just have to be the one to rep. Oh, I will. The, I will, man. Be, because normally we'd have a game. Our world, do you know, Lagos and London. Mm, okay. would, I was going to ask, did you guys want to play against each other or do you just answer the question once? All right. I've won as a team. Uh, I'll represent, man. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll represent. I'll try my hardest. I'll try my hardest. <laughs> I'll, I'll try you. So Let's have, do it. I have, um, 
have history, I have arts and entertainment, I have sports, arts, entertainment, and music. Arts, entertainment, and music, one category. Oh. History, history, one category. General knowledge, one category. So, yeah, let me know. Sports first, please. You want to go sports, but you can't do one um, too much, like one category. It would just be five questions. Okay, okay. You can't do one category, like back to back to back. Oh, okay, to back. okay. So I basically have to do all of them one by one. No, nah, you can do one category like twice, but no, like okay, sports okay, now. Okay, okay, okay. Sports now. Okay, sports now. so yeah, I can't, Obviously, basically can't women's... do it twice in a row. Uh, yeah, it's up to you, but don't, okay. don't, don't, rinse, don't it. rinse it. Yeah. Right, fair enough, fair enough. So, I, um, obviously, Women's World Cup is going on now. Can you name three Super Falcon players? <laughs> Super, uh, I can't. I'll be real. Not even two. I cannot, you know. Not even one? Nah. Hey, I'm, 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 not, I'm that's a, bad. I'm that's a, bad. You, you I'm end up in McDonald's. End up McDonald's <laughs> you will never make it. You will never. You, wow, you, that you are me a up. failure. You are, you are a failure. Why? Hey, you know? Camille, come on, man. Not even one. Super, the ladies. The ladies. Ah, oh, nah. Hey, that's bad, man. That's very that's bad. That's not good. At least in my research, right, I'm so what's sorry. What's the next one, man? At least you'd have known like uh, Asisa Oshala. Ah, fuck. Nah, man. I'm so she sorry. I'm trying, to, now. I'm trying to get in touch with all the... With, with the right, football, which one? Hard. Which one do um, you go? All right, cool. Let's do arts, entertainment and music. Arts, entertainment and music, yeah. What's Bonner Boy's full name? If you give me first name and second name, that's fine. Damini... Oh, you need to give me one more name, man. Damini. Oh, I've seen this. I can't remember. Damini boy. I'll take it. Damini. Hey, Damini. Dan, this boy is embarrassing your podcast Damini. right now. <laughs> oh, what's the last name? It's like oh. You got 2010. What is it? It gives him an O in it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I can't look. That's Ebu a hard Lua. mark. Oluwa. Oluwa. Damini. That's the name you're looking for, okay. the one that we oh yeah. Wow, I try, yeah, man. It's not looking good. Uh, it's not looking good, bro. What what category are you going next? Alright, let's go general knowledge. Yeah, Bunlua Damini Ogulu. Mention three hotel franchises in London. Just to make like the questions will be like we'll blend it like things in London, yeah, things okay. in Nine. Yeah. Hilton. Hilton, okay. Holiday Inn. Holiday Premier Inn. Premier Inn. Holiday Inn and Premier Inn, are they not the same? Nope. All right, then. One so is purple, one is green. Five points. You have two more questions. Sports again. Sports again. So give me five former Super Eagles captain. Five former Super Sp Eagles yeah, captain? It's not, they might, as long as they've captained for like a period. Joseph Yobo. One. Enyema. Two. Jojo Okocha. Three. Tire Tower. Mm. Do you think Tire is captain? I don't, I don't think for an extended period because Tire Tower would have been playing at the same time Okocha was playing. Um, Kani. I don't think. Kani not captain either. Can, can, he, he might have captain one or two games, but like Okocha and Iman, Okocha was the captain as at that yeah, time yeah, Kani was yeah, playing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Five. Don't do me. Hey, bro, nah, nah, I'm nah, going nah, to nah, stop nah, this nah, thing nah, if nah, you nah. fail this one too. Nah, that Taribo. Yeah, Taribo West is the captain. And but that's before your time, though, bro. I'll so, lie. I'll lie. And, <laughs> I'll and lie. Hey, please don't say Guavono. Nah, nah, <laughs> yeah. nah, nah. Come on, man. West Brom. Ah, Ode Wingy was a yeah, captain. Man, I didn't know. On. Yeah, man. Ode Wingy was our captain for time. I didn't know, you know. Yeah. I was even going to say when, when, when Oko Chart was like, yeah, he took over. Remember when Ghana beat us in the yeah, Nations yeah, Cup? Yeah, Junior yeah. Agogo. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I remember times. that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So 10 points, okay. Yeah, 10 points. Then the last one. What, what category do you want? Something music related. Arts, entertainment and music again. Wait, no, general knowledge. You want to go back to general knowledge? Yeah. All right. Then. I haven't used general knowledge, I don't think. You've used general knowledge. What question did I use? Um, What question did you use again? Free hotel franchises. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, let's do what? Yeah, let's do general knowledge one more time. You do general knowledge again, yeah. What is the uh, we've said we've used it before? I'll just use it again. What's the fare? What's the price of a bus fare in London right now? Right now, one pound sixty-five. I'm going. I'm not going to ever use that question again. Man. <laughs> no, but so I just know. Yeah, I like, go on the bus once a week when I go to church. Just once a week, and I hate it every single time. So I don't. So how do you get is. to work? I, I scooter to work. Oh, okay. uh, my workplace is like five minutes away from me. Your scooter, my office. Uh, so you got three. Yeah, out of five. No, so. four. 
Free, 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 free out of five. So that's 15, 15 out of 25. 25. Yeah, pass. You, even if you're in your class, you'd be like, if you're like 50, you'd be like top 20. Yeah, top 20, I'll take that. Yeah, man. So, man by myself as well. No daddy was to help me. I've done good. you done well, you done well. I saw the tastiest guy. He, done, he didn't know anything. What's that? The, the tastiest guy, the, the guy. I said you asked the question, you didn't know. But you done the quiz with him. Which one of them is that? The the bold guy. The, you're one of your most recent guests. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Man, it's like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He didn't know yeah, nothing. Yeah. He didn't know nothing. All right, guys. I, am, I hope you've enjoyed the episode, Come man. on, Come man. on. Allegro Smith's London. Don't Always. forget to like and subscribe. We've got Send Back, boys. Yeah, check out your podcast. Mm -hmm. Send Back Podcast on YouTube. Make sure you like and subscribe. Yeah. All right, guys. This is where Lego Smith's London once again. I, when I say Lego Smith's London, you just say Wahala. That's how Wahala. 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 Thank you so much.